Hey guys, this is the iMods, and today I'm going to show you how to enable internet tethering on an iPhone 3G or 3GS running 3.1.2 firmware. And just real quick, I'm going to show you that I am, in fact, on 3.12. I don't know if it's kind of really hard to read that. But that's 3.1.2 and 7.11 in parentheses. Okay, now. What we're going to do is, first you're going to want to open Cydia. You have to be jailbroken to do this. Because um, there are uh, there are multiple ways to do it, but I did find out that I tried a couple of them and it didn't work. And this is the only one I've successfully gotten to work, so um, I'd recommend it. What you're going to want to do is you're going to go to man Manage. We'll let it reload first. But we're going to want to go to Manage. You're going to want to click Sources. And then once we open Sources, you're going to want to... Um, click edit in the top right then you're going to want to click add and what we're going to do is we're going to add a new repository so once this loads here we go I'm going to go to edit add and then you're going to type in b l a c k r a 1 n sorry dot com and you're going to hit add source I already have it so I'm going to hit cancel but you're going to hit add source wait for it to load and then you're going to go to it once it's loaded there's going to be only one thing it's going to be called black snow you're going to want to install this and then you're going to hit install and confirm once it's installed you'll hit return to Cydia I already have it installed so I'm not going to do that but it'll return you to Cydia just like any other package does and then you're going to want to back out of this you're going to want to open up your uh, not email sorry you're going to want to open up your Safari you're going to want to type in up here you're going to want to do http dot dot slash slash m dot peaceful insanity dot com slash tether dot mobile m o b i l e config and you're going to want to hit go. I'll have that in the um, description, so if you didn't hear that, don't worry. And then it's going to come up to this, US AT&T Tethering. You're going to want to hit install. It's going to ask you, it's going to, mine says replace, but yours will say install now. And you're going to hit it. And then it's going to have you, if you have a passcode, you're going to enter it. And then it's going to say installing profile. And then once it's done, it'll say profile installed profile installed see okay then you hit the done it's gonna go back to the internet you can back out of that now what you're gonna want to do is either either respring which I'll do that through there real quick it doesn't take long at all especially on an, one of the new iPhones and once this loads you're gonna be able to go to settings general network you'll see you have cellular data, cellular data network and now you have a button called internet tether I'm going to turn it on and I'll just show you guys that it works real quick you hit USB only now I'm plugged into my computer you'll see right there there's the that red that you can kind of barely see is the two monitors with an X now you just give it a second that'll change now see it's got two blue with the internet and now Let's see, we'll hit the refresh button. And as you can see, I'm tethering from my iPhone 3GS. Alright, that's it. Um, if you have any questions, you can comment. Please rate and subscribe. And also, there's an email address in the description that you can reach me at. Alright, thank you for watching. Bye.